Forget the match. Oh, no, look, all I'm going to say is <laughs> I, I agree with Ajax, who says, Banjo, you need to show us around when we get to Texas. So I got you. All right, I cool. I'm, 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 I'm glad we can at least get to that point. Oh, hold up. I think we we're about to get started. Oh, is, is Sharp going Joker? Oh, that's cool. I want to see some Joker being played, especially from, you know, the, the general, you know, Banjo, the general consensus about Joker is that the character is um, largely nerfed online because of the finesse required to get a lot of the characters, um, like combo strings. Uh, yes, yes. It required like there's a of course the delay right the input yeah. delay between the input delay between like you know online and offline so it's gonna be really interesting to see you know nice what Wi-Fi Joker can do but Wi-Fi Joker is really gonna be like you know once you know once Dad comes home Arsene then it's game time <laughs> the game the game begins when Arsene comes home and like is how what's your report uh, card looking like bro oh all F's well here comes Arsene and here we go so we got Sharp versus PK Chris. Uh, PK Chris kind of feeling it out. Dash attack. Uh, not gonna be doing a lot here. The side magnet cancels though, but the movement. Yeah, the pressure right now. Sharp getting caught in a blender. I have to ask Sharp like what he likes more about this matchup than Wolf Ness. So I, I just don't. I don't. I wouldn't be able to tell immediately what the big differences are aside from maybe Joker having just a bit more. I mean, it could be Arsene. <laughs> it could be as simple as just I like having Arsene in this matchup. Honestly. Oh, nice call out there by Sharp. He did his trying to stall. Oh, what? What? Uh, what is this, bro? <laughs> what is this? What was that? PK Chris had to steal on the engine platform like, bro. So what? there was this really strange interaction between, I don't know what PK Chris was going for, but Sharp was going for our send power dare. And then he rising back air for the, the kill. I don't understand. <laughs> that was bizarre. Game, let him have that. I don't care what nobody say. Like for real. Like that was like that was like an instant interaction too, which is the crazy part. It's like he buffered it almost. Like nah, bro, that's not real. So uh, Sharp says, "Hey, uh, Joker works. Just watch." And already up a stock. And uh, uh, PK Chris having a little bit of trouble uh, uh, getting rid of that 137.9 percent on Sharp. PK Chris, yeah. what's your game plan here? Because uh, you know, you know when Arsene come back, you know you dead, right? Yeah, Arsene's almost here, but I gotta say one of the things I really like from Sharp is his adept usage of gun in this kind of situation. A good Nair. He's almost got the Arsene coming out. Oh, and Peter Chris again missing his opportunity for a grab. You have to wonder if Peter Chris was shook by that weird interaction to start things off. He had to take a minute in the Angel Blast uh, plot to recover, and now here comes Daddy. Arsene's yeah. out. <laughs> and Arsene is here, so I mean, if you blow up at like, you know, some obscene percent, then you know what happened to you. Ooh, the run through. You can already see the fear. Uh, back air. And are you, oh, oh, he's gonna down gun him to death? Oh, not quite gonna get it. PK Chris able to muscle through it with the PK Thunder, but oh, what a parry! What a parry into Nair! Very well done. And PK Chris evening things up. And yes, as chat pointed out, it was actually rising fair. My apologies. Okay, okay. Oh, I, I gotta say, one of the things that kind of helps Joker is that Arsene basically makes a lot of, like, where his limbs are visually just, like, like, uh, like almost in shadow. But, again, Sharp connecting. Take the stock lead here. You guys just join us. We're in winter semis of MSM Online. Yep. And uh, we got a stock lead coming up for PK Chris right now. And the stock lead coming up for Sharp. Excuse yep. me. Sharp putting in work with uh, with uh, the young man, <laughs> uh, uh, Joker and Arsene. Oh. Did SD, did you? Oh. oh my God! The dare spike off of uh, the recovery right there. And yeah, uh, here we go. One v one v one. One side. I don't think I don't think Sharp intended to go that low, but what a drag down down smash there. Sharp just got caught out. Oh, the down guns. Oh, Peter Chris no, saving himself there with big one, PK Thunder. One hell of a tech right there. PK Chris is taking the DOT. It's just some of the most, <laughs> like, damage over time, bro. Like, come on, dog. It just really feels like Chris is, like, one slight, either one half step behind Sharp. There we go. The down guns are going to do just enough knockback and stun to keep PK Chris from recovering. And, I, I don't know about you, Banjo, but it just felt like Chris was, like, a half step behind Sharp the entire match. Like yeah, there's a uh, lot of like grab whiffs, and I think that, part of it actually has to do with 
the thing, the, one of the problems about fighting Joker is that his um, his hitbox, like the actual character model, is so skinny that where you think you actually have grab range, you actually don't because of how narrow he is. Yeah, like uh, I was looking at this like matchup, and I'm just like, oh, why why did he pick Joker when he could have just went Wolf? And he's like, oh, the down guns uh, off the recovery, and he gimped him very very easily. So, yeah. like, I, and that's what we're gonna be, and that's what I assume what you know sharp is going to be looking for when you as he fights pk chris he's going to be looking for like okay i got this kid in disadvantage now that ness is in disadvantage if it was no matter where he is you know off stage i can just go for like the low commitment right guns right yeah. and go for the low commitment guns and then you know what i'm saying if i get a stock i get a stock or it'll just reset and at and and you know best case scenario our sin is here so now i got the gat off stage not the gun and Maybe the gat will kill, maybe it won't, but right now uh, things are looking real, real good for Sharp in this first game. Not going Wolf, but going Joker. You also have to wonder, just given how mercurial Sharp is about his character selection, if he just goes, oh, the Joker worked. Oh, let me try Sephiroth. Because I feel like he would be the kind of person to do that, <laughs> especially with a game up lead. Oh, uh, hey, not Sephiroth, but the Wolf's out. So let's just see what happens here in game two. All right, Sharp. <laughs> no, I, I like I like the mind games. I do, I do. I appreciate it. You know, not giving him a chance to like you know figure out like uh, you know any character like uh, not giving him a chance to figure out any character matchups. Trying to keep him guessing, keep him on his toes. You also have to wonder if maybe it's some combination of Wolf and Battlefield that he prefers to Joker too. But I will find out. Ah, nice. ah. Baby! Like <laughs> oh my goodness. You like key ball? That's crazy. Oh man. My, I have my... seen so few call outs with F Smash that this rain is emphatically as that. Whew. Sharp is just like, on fire tonight. Like when you air dodge like that, you just get caught. Uh -oh. like, you know what I'm saying? See, like, and once again, just getting set up, like, you try and do an aerial and it's well spaced. And then all of a sudden, oh my goodness, I'm back there. And then all of a sudden, you get set up for like forward smashes like that. 72%. You already got a laughing percent. Are we looking at a three stock? The first three stock of the night. I mean, it might be a little too early to call that one banjo, but right now, Sharp just has PK Chris entirely on the back foot. But here's an opportunity for PK Chris to even it out. Ah, he's not able. He look, he's, he's so tentative about approaching right now because Sharp has just been uh, stuffing him out whenever he tries to land on him. Right, and watch oh, that man. back turn. Oh, watch that, way. yeah. Watch that back turn from Wolf. Not gonna go for it, but will go for the forward tilt. Trying to get yeah. the two frame. Not gonna be able to get. Watch how you go through the classic <laughs> dash attack. Going to kill here, and PK Chris it's... on his last stock hasn't taken one from Sharp yet. Oh. What? Back here, here's the PK Thunder. Oh, just enough to get the gimp. Yeah, and because yeah. I think Sharp probably buffered Uppy, then he was in range to get it. He wasn't yeah. able to switch tack at the side B to work. So far, this has just been a story of Sharp catching PK Chris's landings and making him pay dearly for them. And like in, in the night, like horrible landings either, just bad landings. Definitely, like, and you saw, oh, okay. You're like, you saw how he was waiting, waiting for like PK Chris to land so he can just capitalize with the with the most delicious of punishes. Okay, oh, gonna get nice a parry there. Grab, yeah. Hey, look, at, look at Sharp's movement and just like when he picks to actually go in. Right, just using that jump to kind of just like, you know, see what movement PK Chris offers next and just playing off of that. Oh yeah, I, I like that like platform descending grab attempt from Sharp, but... PK Chris still trying to keep himself in this one. But he has to play so tentatively right now. Oh man, just with enough drift to avoid the back air fall up there that would have been the game. Oh, the VK magnet, Psy magnet, and the back, air. The back air, and he's not gonna have enough to get yeah. back to the stage. So, okay, sharp PK waited crit. too long. Sharp waited too long with the drift there to um, have a, a, enough distance to close it with Uppy. But also, <laughs> sharp cares. <laughs> Let's see how he feels. Yeah, I was gonna say, you know, uh, the last match he was in, like he he gave away a stock like wasn't nothing. Trying to go for the uh, trying to go for the tech follow up. Not going to be able to get it. Sharp at zero percent. PK Chris trying oh, to find oh. the entrance. 
Oh, Chris is so lucky he fell out of that F tilt, and now he can actually pressure Sharp, but Sharp escapes. Sharp now is that PDA Chris kind of... Oh, he had him cornered for a moment. Here, here we go. Trying to heal. Oh! Okay, that was an interesting call out. I, th I think Sharp knew the roll was coming, but he went for a uh, back air instead, and trying to close it out here with the two frame. Oh, not going to catch PK Chris immediately trying to uh, run for cover in center stage. Here we go. Trying to, uh, try to, to oh. Here. Trying to get a little tech follow up. I think he actually could have wolf flashed that for the kill. But I, I don't think you want to go for another risky call out. And again, trying to two-frame PK Chris, not going to get it. Chris survives. Right, get a little, get a little leg. Ooh, oh. That dash attack was uh, a little rough. So Sharp going to be able to go up 2-0 against PK Chris first with the Joker, now with the Wolf. Do you have a third character, Sharp? Or is it just these two? <laughs> I, could be, I mean, he has... <laughs> the man has <laughs> just a wealth of characters to choose from. So all right, we could see the Sephiroth in game three, for all we know. I need to see it for sure. For sure. Before my block is over, I want to see Sephiroth. I want to commentate Sephiroth. Hundred <laughs> percent. But I, 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 can, I still am completely blown away by that call out in game one. Like yeah. You could, you could say that uh, that PK Chris should have tried to land with a hit box or something, but that was like not tremendously dangerous air drift, and Sharp was like, "Oh, turn around, F smash, <laughs> right there." And here we go. Uh, I wonder if he heard me. Maybe. <laughs> Probably. Hopefully. Yeah. I but folks, this uh, will likely, I think, be the last set that uh, Banjo and I commentate tonight. So if we don't get the chance to say so, thank you very much for tuning in and allowing us into your homes for this Monday evenings. Mega Smash Mondays brought to you by 2GG Gaming. Please support the channel with follow any subs you guys got. And uh, don't press one in chat. I don't want to ban last. He seems like a nice person. <laughs> yeah, don't forget, uh, shout out to MetaView as well. Make sure you guys download that on the Apple iOS and to sign up for Android beta. You know what it is. Oh, hey, Banjo, you got your wish. Sephiroth, show me. <laughs> Sharp, show me something gross, man. I need to see it. Look how long that is, bro. This is some serious mind games going on as Sharp's just, I, I, I have to admit, just either willingly or not willingly toying with PK Chris by doing Sephiroth in game three after the first two games. All right, so the one thing that uh, he has to be wary of is, is range, but like the projectile game and utility of Sephiroth is uh, yeah, so, 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 so good. That said, but, Ness has the frame data to get in and ruin Sephiroth's day. So let's see if PA Chris is able to uh, get some momentum here and make Sharp pay for his character choice. And there you go. Big roll call out with the back air. And PK Chris is in the lead, but here comes Sharp. Oh, I'm glad you. I'm glad you went Sephiroth. You just make my job a little bit easier. You, you feel me? Uh, you want Sabu? No. Not even gonna. Not even gonna go for the dare on ledge either. So. That was okay. an interesting mix-up from PK Chris going for a low percentage follow-up, but no dice quite. See, and it's like is it from right now, from what it's looking like from this end, it looks like uh, Sharp has no answers. Right now for this projectile game. Uh, go for the dare. Yes, you are trying to go for the dare. The bud will get the back here. Uh, yeah. you might you might want to watch what you do with that. Oh, nice low game. swing F tell and sharp has evened it up. Yeah, the thing is that with Sephiroth, Sharp can play on the back foot so easily too, just because of what Sephiroth can do with the counter, with the um, the side B, which you see. Uh, affixing itself to PK Chris. PK Chris smartly knowing the time and able to actually absorb it with PK Magnet. Yeah, so like uh, Sharp, he might want to let those stack, right? Might want to let those stack and see if he can get an attack on the back end. Might be a big risk if he tries that, but you know, the reward for a full combo after that. Uh, that was the slowest throw I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and how we got the one wing out, angel bro. out here for Sharp Sephiroth, but. Right, you're gonna get the armor on the smash attack, so if there's any time for you to swing, this might be it, especially uh, as you get higher in those percents. Oh. The back air 86, now you definitely wanna use those smash attacks. 
Again, just opted for da right. down tilt instead. Just a little bit off. The PK Chris. Oh, the sword actually claimed with the yo-yo. And now PK Chris is way in the blast zone. He doesn't want to be there right now. Three jumps. Once again, the two frame not going to get it here. Watch oh, your right. Look, look at Sharp holding center stage right now. <laughs> just like a Grim Reaper. Oh, big counter. He not used that at all so far. Oh my goodness. Just maintain the middle of the stage. Has yeah. one wing angle. Chris can't escape that other that side of the stage. Oh, Sharp almost got caught out there with a the down smash though. <laughs> Ooh, and the F tilt, just so much damage and down smash? Nope. Oh, we almost got down tilt again, but it's a dash attack. Sharp's playing this super patiently. Yep. He finally has the down tilt. Oh! He was fishing from that all game, and he finally gets the follow-up, and now Sharp is in the lead. Here we go, PK Chris, fighting for tournament life right here, and is still in it. 0-0, zero, zero, one stock apiece. PK Chris, like I said, fighting for uh, the, the winner's side life right now, trying to at least put themselves on the board, and Sharp looking to get into winner's finals in this contest. Uh, oh, okay. Bad for Sharp right now. PK Chris is on the back foot completely. He's managed to stay out of the range so far of some Sephiroth's neutral moves. Uh oh, but here's the one wing angel. Can Sharp turn things around right now? Yep, you got the comeback factor. 93%. Trying not to overcommit, trying to catch him in these, in these air, uh, air dodges. Sharp. Woo! Oh, the dash attack of the platform actually saved PK Chris for a minute. Oh, spot to. Oh, what a sequence of PK Chris. He actually almost did this, the. Shield break if Sharp had less shield health, but Sharp knowledgeable about the roll rule, which if you are being hit with a multi-hit on shield, you can roll back after it's the 13th hit. Right, I'm just trying to accumulate a little bit more damage. 85% Sharp is on the brink. Oh uh, no, he tried to eat the he tried to eat the hitbox there, just like earlier on instead um gonna fall victim to PK Thunder 2. And PK Chris is gonna give us a game four. I think he might have been looking for counter off the uh off that um Yeah. It's just I, not enough time. It's just not fast enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh yeah, he he went for it and honestly like it might have been uh <laughs> it might have been just better just to just stay on stage and just let the situation kind of reset itself. But all right, but here we go. Uh what is that there? This is uh Game three. Ooh. Or game game four. Three. Game four. My bad. My bad. Game four. <laughs> it's a it's a particularly late night from for uh my friend here, Banjos, joining us all the way from the great state of Texas. Thanks again for uh doing commentary tonight, man. It's been really right. fun. Uh, thank you and thank you and thank you and two GG for having me. I really appreciate it. It feels it feels real good to be back, man. And this is all I wanted. I wanted to see Sephiroth do Sephiroth things, you know. Now Oh, <laughs> zero suit. Ah, ah, ah. what is this? Zero suit, zero suit. time. Okay. okay. This is zero suit is actually one of Sharp's comfort picks, so okay. I'm not that surprised they busted around. Yeah. All right, we're right, back to PS2, and this time PK Chris is taking it right to Sharp. This is one of those matchups where Ness can be the aggressor without suffering too much for it. Yeah, I'm 74% to uh to like a, to zero, so it's, it's looking really really good for uh for Sharp at the moment. And once again, we have this uh this tail of like range against uh, PK Chris. But once PK Chris gets in, he's just letting you know the uh, not autopilots, but he's able to just uh, get all these uh, really really good combos and put his opponent at disadvantage. I'm trying to wait to see what they do next, so that way he can formulate the game plan after that. Back you have here. to wonder if, if Sharp needed to warm up the CSS a little bit, but we're going to find out. Oh, what a landing there, dash tag, ca catching Sharp trying to roll away. Oh, yeah, oh. no one oh. holding that. Oh, my goodness, and that looked like it didn't kill, but damn. PK yeah, Chris yeah. up CSS a shot. CSS is light, so. Yeah. <laughs> Back in the space. This is Earth. We don't even work here. Go, go in there. Okay. Yeah, I think Chris is way more confident with this matchup. <laughs> yeah, PK Chris actually putting in the work right now. Oh, 91% sharp. What's the move here? Oh, the downshot's not working either time because PK Chris could actually space himself 
with the drop down PK Thunder from Ledge. Well, look at those back airs, Chris. I, I feel like he's starting to build momentum here. Oh, Shark needs to figure way. out. Uh, he might need to figure out some way to avoid this going to a game five because Chris, the way he's playing right now, is playing very dangerously. Wow, Sharp, uh, sh uh, PK Chris just turned his back on Sharp right now. Oh, no. Oh, and the oh, weight. Oh. oh, my goodness. Woo! I like where that combo was using forward tilt, though, off the punish. Not going to be able to get it, but gets a PK Chris out. <laughs> oh, my goodness. PK Chris says, bruh. If you don't come at me with your best, you yeah, might be going to losers. PK Chris in the lead right now. Three stocks to one. Yeah, you have to Try wonder to... what Sharp is going to do here because it, it, in other cases, it would be like, okay, you take the losing data and you use it for, you know, game five. But the, the ZSS hasn't made any kind of impact so far. It hasn't been able to take the stock yet. And I just don't know what he can really learn if he if he if he's to just decide to go ZSS again or if he's to try and pick something else. Because you I mean you have to I, uh, I, almost wonder if we're gonna see the Joker or the Wolf again. I have to assume that he's memeing because like in those two games where you but I I, I have to because like in those two games oh, oh my goodness, try to get the uh, Oh man. Chris is feeling game. himself. This is not good for Sharp. <laughs> Even whiffing something like that, you just have to feel the utmost confidence to go for something like that after losing game one and two in such emphatic fashion. PK Chris on the cusp of getting to game five right now. 85% and you know how the light zero suit is, so watch out for your side man that cancels in the back here. A couple more of these projectile setups and you're going to be uh -oh. in shape. Oh, no. And that's with the jump. The air dodge, not going to be able to capitalize off of it. The sharp, sharp is a little bit off on that one. Yeah, Chris is just looking for those back ears right now. <laughs> yeah. PK Chris just trying to play just super, super, just uncommittal, right? Just go, look at that. Going for the jab, <laughs> going for the down tilt into grab, trying to get the back throw. Not going to be able to punish that, uh, oh. that Tevin throw, though. The sharp first effort has been denying PK Chris over and over and over. And to keep it up, the back throw, not going to get the kill at this point. But. Ooh, good parry. Oh, what a parry. It's so hard to deal with ZSS's downbeat in non Wi Fi situations. So, man, yeah. hats off to PK Chris for that big parry right there. Ooh, you are oh, we fell out of dash attack. Woo! Yep, and the uh, forward there, not going to take it yet. Stage control. Uh oh, uh, very. Oh! I was going to say. My was man, with, my man PK Chris with the lightning f fast mash out there. Like, yeah. Sharp are way more committed to just nailing him with the up B. He thought he had all the time in the world to go for it. Okay, okay. <laughs> I see you. Uh, <laughs> so, here we are. Game five. Yo. So, clearly, you was out here just, you know, playing for the memes. You was playing for MetaView, bro. I, I appreciate it. You was playing for MetaView. You said, we need to give, we need to give MSM content. We need some that content. content. <laughs> we need some, some crispy content for the night. But I think uh, uh, playtime is over. So, so uh, are you gonna go wolf or are you gonna let it rot? I, I feel like we gotta see the wolf back. <laughs> Chat is hilarious right now. <laughs> like I don't like. It's just like when it's just like when you play a character like ZSS where her moves are plus, like on on like on shield, bro. It's just like. Well, okay, I'm gonna just start throwing stuff at you if it's gonna be like this, and I'm gonna just wait for you to whiff, whiff on stuff. Yeah. And, and lo and behold, and lo and behold, uh, Sharp was whiffing with the zero suit, and now Sharp is finding themselves in a game five situation, trying to get to winner's final of today's MSM Mega Smash Mondays online. Two GG. Holla at your boy, Banjo Fro on the ones and twos, hey. providing you that quality commentary. <laughs> and and it's just like and it's just like I, I feel like <sighs> I feel like this is this this might be my fault because I, I told this man to go separate and he shouldn't have did it. Wolf and Joker was the way the whole time, but it's okay. So I'm gonna so I'm gonna be like, all right, he's gonna go Wolf, and he's gonna he's gonna stop the BS, bro. Like, cause he let it. You let it get this far, right? So I, I, I feel like playtime is over. So here we go. Sharp, 
Go ahead and go ahead and play Wolf. Let's get a Kraken. Oh, oh we're gonna go Joker. Joker. Okay, okay. All right, cool. All right. Here we go, folks. Game five of <laughs> winter semis. I forgot we're not in. Uh... Well, it felt like a winner, fi winner's final set, to be honest with you. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Man. Three, two, one, go! So PK Chris versus Sharp. Game five situation. Now, we saw in uh, the last match, right, uh, we saw Guns did the job, right? We saw yeah, Guns basically, uh, basically snipe PK Chris. Uh, out in the blast zone, so you know it's gonna be on PK Chris to make sure you stay static if you, if you want. You know what I'm saying? Stay static with your movement, stay static, but try to just you know, if I'm PK Chris, you know I would try to just make sure you stay away from the left, right? Especially when our send comes out, because that's when the BS starts. You can see that PK Chris is just there's some he's starting to calm down right now, but there's definitely some like a little bit of like tenseness, and some apprehension. He's got to be throwing out some hurt boxes and affecting his air drift some folks would consider that you know trying to slay some ghosts but in this kind of situation against the player of sharps caliber you have to do whatever it takes in order to make sure you don't get hit here we go on the platform shenanigans on ps2 that he's dragged down the drag down but wait nothing yet oh. that was an interesting mix-up attempt from sharp <laughs> didn't quite work we love to see him go for something different Right, and not even needing our sin yet. 96% to 32. Sharp says, let's go. I got the lead. Oh, the guns to carry over onto the other side of the stage. And getting cornered oh. from coast to coast to drag down up here into the up smash. Sharp not is going to die. Kill. Oh, and he gets it this time around. Those drag down up airs are just so deadly. It's so hard to avoid them. Sharp said, another one. And now our sin is out. Let's get the, dam the damage up. Accumulation going right now. Yeah, Sharp's that Sharp, back air hurts. Sharp's been in the driver's seat since about midway through that first stop. Yeah. And, and it hasn't been so much of a, like, you know, getting getting dominated. It's like this whole push pull mechanic in these trades that, you know, in these exchanges that Sharp has just been winning over time. And like yeah. I said, like, like, and it's happening here. Right, it's like okay. Well, if you're gonna go on the other side of the stage, I'm gonna go ahead and respect your space. I'll I'll peck at you with these with these nine millimeter guns, right? So that way I'll get my damage, and you know you can think that you can come in, but then if you whiff, then I'm gonna hit you with you know a whole combo or something like that. There we go. Again, Sharp just feels slightly one step ahead with the Joker on PK Press. A little back air, right? Ooh. Good parry. Back and forth between the two right now, but the big difference that Sharp's a full stock ahead of PK Chris. Right, well, that's using, how you... using those jumps to just oh the no. The drag down into up smash once again. Will the third time be the charm? Sharp at 82 uh... percent Because visually it feels like the jumps are their commitment, but they're not. <laughs> and so Sharp can just keep doing it over and over again to make it so that Chris just loses his nerve and has to commit and you pay for it. Yeah, and uh, with Arsene out, like, the damage keeps accumulating. Here comes the DOT and one bad trip off stage, and I can see some shenanigans happening. Here we go. The back air. Oh, the back oh, the air. Bear, excuse me. And guns. Chris right now is just trying to escape desperately, but oh, no! You bucking, bro, and not again. A third time, the up smash into... <laughs> The, uh, the up air into up smash off the plat. Will it happen a third time? And the yo-yo will connect. One stock gone, PK right. Chris. Chris is Waking still in up. this one. He just has to desperately avoid being stuck on plat and falling prey to an up air. Because Sharp will just drag him down to an up smash. You can see, look at Chris, he's actually actively avoiding the plat somewhat. Oh. Yep. 106% sharp. Let's nice move here. Oh, Whoa. you are bold, my friend. The down smash on ledge, not gonna connect. BK Chris fighting for their life right now. The up air. Oh, the Joker twice, can escape with the jump to guns. Sharp right now. He's playing this so well defensively. Chris is stuck. Oh, but finally it's the fair to work, but. Oop. The guns are gonna do it. And the guns. 
blap, 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 blap in his way into winner's finals of tonight's MSM. Sharp with the guns. Looking cool, Joker. Oh my goodness. And it was just a waiting game, right? 